Sam Williams is like sitting out there in, in the bullpen in a cold day, zero zero score, and you know I'm sure you had to be alert at any time to go in. Definitely, um, it was <clears throat> like like you said, it was it was a long game. It was a lot of fun. It was fun to watch everybody come out of the pen and and do their job. And when my name was called upon, I just wanted to go out there and do the same. Going three innings, how do you? Was it all adrenaline? I mean, I don't know how you're feeling out there. Yeah, it was. It was a good amount of adrenaline. Um, I think that had to do with the situation. Uh, the crowd. The crowd was awesome. The, the atmosphere here was unbelievable today, and and they were loud. Um, but yeah, just just wanted to go out there and, like I said, do my job, like like everybody who came in before me. When you're in that spot of the games, you know, scoreless, and like one mistake might be, you know. Yeah, is your pressure or um not really. I mean, I think in these playoff games and towards the end of the game, coming out of the bullpen, you you pitch in situations that every pitch matters, especially in the playoffs, and and that's how you have to attack it as a relief pitcher. Um, but I just wanted to go out there and and throw strikes and let the defense take care of the rest, and they did a phenomenal job today. So, what was your reaction when uh, Oscar? Hit that ball. You immediately knew it was out, I suppose. Yeah, I think everybody in the stadium knew that it was out right away. Um, but it was a lot of fun. It's, it's fun to watch him. I came up with him um, in the minor leagues, and it's cool to see the rest of the world now gets to see what he can do. Did you know he could do this long for us? Um, I think there's a there's a quiet confidence um, in our group of guys that we have here, and we come to the ballpark every day and. We don't really back down from challenges. That's that's preached from Tito, um, and I think it's kind of instilled in us, and and that's how we attack each day. Sam, did they keep asking you about can you go out for one more inning? Can you you know, or did you have that? Did you think you were going to do multiple? Innings? Um, I I didn't know it. Like um, I think it was the thirteenth or fourteenth inning. Our bullpen was getting kind of thin. There weren't a ton of guys down there, um, so I knew I was going to go out and have to throw at least probably two innings. Um, if it if the score stayed the same, um, so I was prepared for it, but I was ready to go back out for the third, um, and had a lot of help on the defensive side. When you mentioned you had the Jose's and the Baylor play there in the twelfth, just be see better on the I mean, it was it was unbelievable. They, they, those two made a couple of unbelievable plays today, um, and I think it was in the fourteenth inning um, that double play that Jimenez and Naylor and Rosie um, took care of was huge uh, just to get out of that inning and and give our hitters a chance to go up there and, and win the game was enormous. You noticed that the hitters were getting frustrated with shadows and all that. Was that affecting you too? Uh, not really. I think it's um, it's just a part of the game and it was the time of day. Um, but you don't really think about that too much when you're out there pitching. Um, but it was... It was just fun that the that the shadows kind of subsided and Gonzo was able to see one up. That was the longest scoreless tie by any postseason history. It was five hours of sheer pressure, drama. What was it like? How would you describe the afternoon? It was, I mean, looking back on it, it was, it, you described it pretty well. Um, I think it was, there was a lot of, um, high pressure situations uh, throughout the entire game. I mean, like you said, it was a scoreless tie um, and everyone was just fighting to get that first run. And um, we're, we're very lucky that Gonzo came out. You getting the lengthy champagne showers? Yes, I'm, I'm pretty cold right now. <laughs> Great job. Thank you guys.